I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Oh, oh, oh no, we're in. <laughs> Hi, guys. Welcome to yeah, another Building Across the Pond stream. This is episode 12. And we have today, we have Hogwarts Great Hall, set number is 75954. With me is Corey, as always. And we've got a special guest down below who is Stand Alone Bricks. So give him a, a good hello. I need to get rid of this banner because you can't see anyone's names on here. <laughs> but yeah, we're here. We're here again. How are you doing, everybody? Hogwarts Great Hall, 878 pieces released in 2019. Yes, it is, isn't it? Yeah, it is uh, 2019. Standalone showing some of the amazing stickers we were admiring in the set. It's soon to be um, retired, this set, isn't it? End of the year. Well, see, this is the last yeah. one that I need besides the new room of requirement, that little itty bitty one. Yeah. To go with all of them. So, like, it's I've got the clock tower, the whomping willow, the astronomy tower, and the great hall. And this is the last one I need built. So, once I have it built, I'm going to move my display and I'm going to set up a whole oh, Harry yeah. Potter thing. It should be great. Elaine is with us again. Good to see you again. And it should be enjoy the build. But guys, just so you all know, we're going to do one hour and 30 minutes building today. Well, it's live streaming. Somebody has a birthday coming up very soon. So he's got to go cook himself a birthday dinner. <laughs> yes, they got people coming over for birthday dinner. Yeah, I'll come over. They'll send it through the internet. <laughs> so we're going to drag this out. Yeah, who have we got with who us? Who we got in the chat? Who we, yeah, the who we got in the chat? We've got Orange Bricks. He is here. Welcome, Orange yeah. Bricks. He's 80s. He's life. Then we've got Cat Bio is here as well. Cat Bio is in Bricks Toys' stream for a long time. Juan Gabriel Carreno. I don't know if that's how you say it, but that was know. pretty that was better than I would have done. <laughs> Glad you took the reins on that one. <laughs> we've got Lego. Oh, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here. We've got Mr. Berry. Good to see you along. Hello. We've got Florine. She's with us on the stream. We've got loads of really cool stuff and ideas at the moment. So if you get on ideas, check that out. She's got a Kingfisher. Really love that. We've got someone called a, a Hobbies. Help. <laughs> Never heard of him before. Uh, who else have we got on here? We have got Pixel Power. Oh, wrong one. Sorry. We've got Pixel Power. Elaine's here. And we've also got Lego Joe. I'm not sure I've seen you in the stream before, so hello, welcome, welcome to the stream. Lego Joe, Pixel Power, Mr. And Barry. Last but not least at the moment is Lego Dad UK. So I want to say hello to everyone. So Corey, everyone that knows, knows me and Corey, and we've got a new guy with us today, is Standalone Bricks. Um, he's come along to do this build of us. We're doing it today and next Sunday as well. So it's going to be quite a fun one. If you've got any questions you want to ask Standalone Bricks, pop it into the chat and he'll reply in the chat. All right, so how many pieces have we got for this? 878. I thought it was 1,000. No, that's fair enough. 878. See, that you guys have no idea. You just know there's a bunch in a box. Yeah. Just the box with the name yeah. I'm most excited. We have a swack load of minifigures in here, like most Harry Potter. We've got two, four, six, eight, ten of them, but I'm most excited for this nearly headless neck. And I think this, uh, what is that, a brick built bath basculus? Is that all of it is right there on the front? Yeah, that looks quite cool, huh? Yeah. Right, let me sort my bags out. So, yeah, we've got six bags. Well, Hut Hutz is here now. What is it? Welcome to the stream. Like our dad said, that he built this, uh, rebuilt this a couple of weeks ago. Now, I, I like when you get these good base plates. It's really good. One piece boat here. All right. So, so right, let's get this open. And we're going to race to see you can get as much done an hour and a half. No, I'm not racing. <laughs> <laughs> Do you all have more Harry Potter sets or is this your page? No, we've, <laughs> we've got so many. Um... <laughs> yeah. I just finished. Uh, I don't want to grab it. I'm gonna end up breaking it, aren't I? I'll get the big bit. Albus so can... Dumbledore. Uh, Harry Potter sets: Astronomy Tower, Night Bus, Clock Tower, Whomping Willow, Hagrid's Hut, Hogwarts Express. Oh, I might have broke it. <laughs> Rise of Voldemort. 
yeah, we've got loads of loads of Harry. I think I might rename it to Lego Harry Potter Fan UK because it's just what I'm doing at the moment is Harry Potter. Make another one. Have to change it. Who have we got in? We have got Solo is in. Hi, Mr. Berry. I did see you said hello a second ago, but my mouse decides to play. I don't know what. Elvis Dumbledore. So, yeah, we've got a few people in the stream. We've got 16 watching. So, thank you all for watching. Wow. Oh, got a nice manual. I haven't even opened anything yet. <laughs> oh, that's quite cool. Right, I'm going to build. So, I start from the back. <laughs> start from bag six. We got them. Uh, this is obviously in an earlier movie because all the kids are very young here. Yeah. So, yeah, let's have a look. See what we're getting here. That's a, that's a tell you what, a, that is a strange bag for a first bag of Harry, Harry Potter. The Harry Why? Potter. Because you're building the, the snake, the basket. Yeah, and my, most of the figures, by the looks of it. <laughs> for, for us, is awesome. Some real Potter heads you are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I read it as pot heads. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's not that. that. Yeah, so, uh, see, tell you what, it seems a long time since last Sunday. How's it? I don't know why. We I did think the Razor Crest. A couple of Razor Crest last Sunday. Yeah. Seems like a long time ago, but that was good fun. I don't know if you noticed this right here. I, I got tired of staring at the first floor, so I put the... Oh, you finished it? I so didn't finish it. There's still the... Uh, Nearly done. The shot. other half, right? You got the apartment. Nice. But I made it more, um, more complete looking anyway. Yeah, I reckon if I grow my hair out, I could look like Dumbledore. <laughs> wow, that's, that's a really cool piece. The sorting hat. Yeah, I wonder if that's the same as the old moulds, because it looks very similar. But it is cool. That is a cool piece. It's taking me forever just to get the minifigures together here. <laughs> so I've, I've, only done one. I've only built Dumbledore, and that's it. This is yeah, very cool is in. Now, mate, thank you for coming along. Brick Toys, uh, do you know I've got to get used to seeing his little picture he's changed now. That's so I know, oh, who, I know who he is. But I like that's cool. We're gonna have you to get you one sorted out. He's I'm like going through to comment on his his first video, right? For his minifigure giveaway. <laughs> so I'm scrolling through my subscriptions and I'm like, where did he go? Like, where is he? I'm going back and forth. I'm like, why can I not find him? And then I'm like, oh right, it's a new picture. <laughs> Do you know, I've done that with myself when I change mine. Yeah. I'll put a comment somewhere. <laughs> oh, Lordy, I'm on somebody else's studio. Yeah, what's going on? But now, so it looks like we've got a good bunch of guys here. If you've got any questions you want to ask Standalone Bricks about his channel, he does a lot of uh, sort of, he's doing a mock at the moment. Do you know, I can't even get Dumbledore's wand in his hand. Oh, I don't <laughs> do the wands. I've said that before, hey? I leave the wands as is. You should leave them and use them. You can use them for mocks. They're really good for windows. Well, we got Harry Potter. Potter? we got Draco Malfoy. Now, are they all got the same jumpers except for Malfoy? Yeah. Well, no, the tie's different. Hermione, yeah. they're, they're their house ties, right? Hermione yeah. Granger and a young-looking Albus Dumbledore. And we got our sorting hat. And we got our... Closed wing Hedwig. The trim's different as well, isn't it? If you look at the um look at the trim on Malfoy's jumper, it's green as well. Yeah. Down at the bottom there. Yeah, so you've got green trim. Yeah, good minifigures as always. Uh Blitz Bricks is here. Welcome yeah, to the scene there. Pop in. Hello. I know that um, Standalone Bricks has a couple of the other Harry Potter sets as well because he's got building the clock tower up on his channel. Yeah. Uh, well, we've got a good question from Orange Bricks. What do you guys think of the Batwing? Oh, I love it. I think it's brilliant. I can't wait. Can't wait to see that but properly in the flesh. Day one. Like yeah, I really want to get that. It looks really cool. Day one for me, man. I'm excited for that set. I just really hope that we're going to get a gift for purchase. I don't think we're going to, but you never know. I'm going to email Lego anyway. You never know. I'm excited. About my, about, my, uh, 
maybe a Joker, have a Joker car next year. That'd be awesome. Especially that purple color. <laughs> I know Brick Toys is not getting it. No, Brick Toys is not getting the Batwing. a, &A Hobbies is going to get the Batwing. I'm glad it doesn't come out until near the end of October. That's the, that's the one saving grace is we've got a bit of time. I was like, oh, they finally gave us a little bit of planning time. How nice is that? <laughs> and it's like, nope. <laughs> no, it's like, oh, here's uh, here's our next Master Builder series. Oh, by the way, it's four hundred and fifty dollars, and it comes out in three days. <laughs> oh, thanks. And they go, here's a little wand, not a wand. Here's a uh, what do you call it? Um, a lightsaber that you can have, but you can only get it if you buy it on day one. And you need to get it now. That was, I think, that was the problem, wasn't it? It's you've got to buy it. You got to buy it now. Yeah. Oh, I changed it for me, man. Brickman's here. Hello, mate. Thank you for joining us. All the way from New Zealand. I say it every time he comes on, it just it amazes me that how far we can reach just by doing this on the internet. But, uh, two slow pieces on backwards, I think. Yeah, too many expect. Yeah, we've got too much money to spend. Um, nice. And Jazz is telling you to keep some money for the helicarrier. Don't spend it all. <laughs> What is that that uh, Stan has got there? Is it the door? Yeah, I think he's let me just pop one. Yeah, he's doing quite well on that. He's already done the boat. Has he done uh, the obelisk as well? <laughs> yeah. Here I I got this whatever this is. You're motoring away. Um I oh. say cards, you, you can't have my offspring. Oh, <laughs> that's a phoenix. That's yeah, a that's a, now what's his name? Do you know his name? I know his name. Phoenix. Anyone in the chat know Dumbledore's bird name? I know what it is, but I'm not going to say anything. I know it's a phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> Jean Grey. Yeah, that's Jean Grey. That's not, it's, not <laughs> it's Jean Grey. <laughs> the Lego Dad UK casually building with a knife. This <laughs> is for Stan. He's just got his knife laid out just in case something goes sideways. We are prepared. <laughs> you never know. In case our basilisk comes comes alive. <laughs> well, we've got Bricks or Pixel. I didn't see who's here. Good to see him. And he got it bang on. Spelt wrong, but it's, it's Forks, as in Guy Forks. <laughs> and that is my knowledge of Harry Potter. <laughs> it's done. I don't know anymore. Probably a good time to to plug. Make sure everybody checks out everybody else's channels, including the people in the chat. Yeah, let's have a look at the banner. Stick the banner up. There you go. I always forget about the banner. And uh, yeah, it's been a eventful week. It's been quite good. There are 15 people watching, and a lot of these guys have YouTube channels as well. So. <laughs> all support each other yeah that's, that's i think that's what you can do isn't it we just support each other help each other out great yeah phoenix is forks good old forks bit combustible don't he? <laughs> so that's quite it's quite a nice little little build because you can tell what it is just by yeah random little bricks i didn't know what it was <laughs> <laughs> i thought i thought it was the mouth of the basket <laughs> I was like, "What? This is." They, they do have a little scrap. I got it after I was holding it upside down. So much. <laughs> Brick toy said he's uh, he learned two things today. Plug your laptop in when you're using it for streaming, <laughs> and get a better webcam. <laughs> yeah, definitely with the old uh, plug it in. Oh, that one wasn't very good. Uh, I'll be back. iPhone wants an update. Oh, that's that new one that gives you some new way of using. I won't say a name because it'll go off, but use uh And we've got Schmei, is it? Atty Schmei. Thank you for popping along. Good to see you. Oh, I've got stickers. Um, quite a strange, you're right. It's quite a strange first bag here. I finished watching all Harry Potter movies and I read the plot summary of The Cursed Child and was very disappointed. Yeah, see, I haven't... I just realised I've got two lots of stickers, haven't I? Um, I haven't watched that Cursed Child and... Yeah, I'm not sure. 2019. <laughs> the Cursed Child. 
<laughs> I just, I'm just laughing at what Elaine's put on there. I'm ready to throw <laughs> Burrow. <laughs> it's right. I'll catch it. I'll, I'll build it. It's fine. Is no, it? You, can it? Say, you can throw it over my way. Yeah, I'll have it. I don't mind. That set's hard to come by right now. Still yeah, you can't even get it in the UK. We well, get it in the UK in different shops, but you can't get it from Lego. I haven't seen it. Like uh, Walmart's up here, they have a lot of the Harry Potter stuff. Oh my god, that was bad. Oh well, it is what it is. Good old sticker. <laughs> the sticker streak ends at the crooked sticker. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I haven't seen like how I can't get a sticker on this thing. You know, I think I'll put a crooked sticker on the other on the other one. Um, on the big diagonally, I think I've got a couple on a bit crooked, but I was like, ah, well. Why would you have got a sticker on crooked when you're streaming for seven hours on end? Yeah, I don't know. Might have been a bit tired. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Brixel Pixel. Yeah. 27 subscribers. Congratulations. It's hard to build up. Hang on. Let's have a look. Hold on. Where are you? What are you doing? That's oh, gone. <laughs> oh, this not my finest hour. Okay. <laughs> that, they are, they are all, that always looks like it's been a by a drunk. <laughs> Trunk Dumbledore. That's it. Trying to put it on. Some days you got it. Some yeah, I think um, you don't. Know. Stanley's doing all right. Ellie's got. Yeah, those um, are great. They're really weird stickers, aren't they? Really nice, but very different. Well, they're the mirror. It's supposed to be yeah. the mirror, right? Yeah, that's really cool. I like that. It's good. It's good. I'm putting these ones on now. <laughs> They kind of remind me of the carbonite stickers from the. Oh, these little stickers are weird, aren't they? Nineteen and twenty. Yeah, Floyd said, uh, "Yeah, ruins your whole day when you get your stickers wrong." Yeah, yeah. especially with those horrible clear ones. It leaves your fingerprint underneath as well. It depends on what set it is. If I'm yeah. really invested in the set, then I want them to be straight. How many stickers do you reckon the? Back wing is going to have. <laughs> um, probably think think like in the console or whatever. I think. Yeah. Like uh, in the cockpit. There's definitely a Batman one that's going to be behind the seat. Have Let's see. I put. So this whether in. that's going to be. Well, I've got to put a sticker on that as well. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> that little triangular piece. Yeah. yeah, I know. That's what I said. A little right. teeny triangle, and you got to put it on there. And again, after a application of those stickers, I said, this is not my finest hour. <laughs> yeah, that went good. <laughs> not good at all. It's quite nice. I have some nice gold pieces to start with, but I say it's a weird, it's a very strange way of starting the build, isn't it? Brickman 179, one set that I really like the looks. Oh, it's easy to, easy to read. It's a Spectral Patron. Yeah. It so, has the mentors in there that. My daughter has that set. I haven't got that one yet. It's only a small one, isn't it? Yeah. I did see it somewhere for a bit cheaper, but I never really picked it up. Well, it comes with a trans blue, like, deer or whatever. Yeah, or that. yeah it's Harry's uh, Expecto Petroleum. Yeah. Thank you, so that's why I got it for my daughter, because I knew she would like them. Yeah. All right, I'm catching up the standalone. Watch out. We're coming after you. They're nice and shiny, though, hey? Like, the way that my light to catch them is just very it's reflective really of how I'm feeling. <laughs> that, that and it, what's his name from um, Cars? Ciao. <laughs> uh, lightning bolt. Addy Schmai, what is your favorite Lego theme? All of them. <laughs> yeah, Lego. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't met a Lego theme I haven't liked. Yeah, it's just it's just Lego. No, uh, probably Star Wars for me. Yeah, it's yours is Star Wars. Uh, I don't really have a favourite theme. Well, I probably have a favourite style, which is the mechs, but then I'm, I'm really enjoying these Harry Potter sets. And I think it's going to get me into modulars doing that diagon alley. So I'm just trying to get my sticker on straight. <laughs> yeah, you the are really nice. They're just expensive. Like, they're an expensive thing to get into. Yeah, yeah. But I'd love to set up a seat. I one day. Yeah, one pretty much like the commanders. Yeah, the commanders are cool. And we've got M Productions in the house. Thank you for joining us. 
Hello, M Productions. Well, I'm actually going to build something that's going to make sense now because all we've got is that and a few minifigs. <laughs> It's just strange. I've got the coffee. I'm going to grab that in a sec. Four of these, hey? Right, I'm going to quickly, if I can, if you'll let me, without crashing my laptop. I'm just going to load a web page up quickly. Right, what we're doing now. So we are building the who? The, the basilisk. That's the one. There you go. But he's already there. Why do you don't get a sword of Gryffindor with this? Nah, I don't think you do, do you? Bit of shame. Doesn't look like it. But we did get one. What set did that come in? That, uh, well, the proper one is with um, Grip Hook in the minifigure series just come out. Right with that little goblin. goblin yeah. Yeah, yeah, Grip Hook. Grip Hook. Right, we have got what's that there? Brickman, uh, Hot Fort on the Hogwarts Crest art set. Yeah, it looks really cool. Um, it'd be interesting to see how many pieces it's going to be. With them trying to do it all in one. Yeah, I think it's going to be about 4,000, I think they're saying, or 4,500, so a few more. Because otherwise you're not going to be able to do all the uh, houses because of all the different colours. But it's, it's interesting. It'd be good to see what it looks like. And if you build the actual thing, are you going to have to get all four sets to put them all together? We can do them smaller to do the, I don't know. Well, they have uh, quite a few more art themes coming out, though, don't they? Like some landscape stuff or something? I did see. I saw something today, but I can't think <laughs> what it was. Another art set. Um, oh, guys in the chat, if you know which one I'm talking about, there's another one. Not the not the Harry Potter one. There's another no, it's, it's a different, yeah, like a different theme. Oh, yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. It's, it's along the lines of Andy art. Warhol sort of thing. So it's like an actual art one. Uh, they're doing an Elvis. That's it. Yeah, Elvis. There you go. They're doing an Elvis. Andy but there's another one that was more like just in the realm of art, art. Like, yeah, yeah. Like... I think that's pushing along to like, um, what's his name? Andy Warhol. So I'm sure he'd done a painting of uh, Elvis. Possibly. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know. You're buffering. I'm having problems. Uh oh. He's running, running the cocoa net. <laughs> That's because standalone's using all your bandwidth. He's building so quick. <laughs> they do really well. Let's start. I don't oh, think when you're hosting, is is clicking and doing that, but I don't care. I mean, we don't mind, do we? I don't mind at all. It takes as long as it takes, but yeah, we'll have a uh, see how we're getting on with this basilisk. Do you know what? I'm actually this basilisk. I'm just thinking, wouldn't that make an interesting big set? A big just do, set. Just do a massive basilisk. Yeah, that'd be quite cool. I'm put his head on upside down here. <laughs> like flipped him right around. That just looked funny. Well, they make a couple of big serpent style sets in the uh, Ninjago line. Yeah, yeah, just um, I can't remember what one's is it, is it just called a snake? I think I don't know. <laughs> I think uh, it's cool. That's the what I like. I don't know if I can pick it up. So they put those trans yellow pieces in here. Oh, for the eyes, put the slope piece over top of them, and it really makes the eyes look countersunk. That's really cool. But he is a he's a, he's a wee bit short. They probably could have gone with a couple more links on them, I think. Perhaps it's just a baby basilisk. Me. He hasn't quite grown up yet. For Harry Potter 8. All right. Bag 2. So I never thought um, M Productions are saying start a podcast. I never really thought about a podcast. Oop, I only spoke with drink I have got something interesting happening tomorrow. Hopefully. I've Got my Lego Ideas chat video coming out, as usual, on a Monday. I need to edit it yet. <laughs> I have done that yet. Um, and the Brick Post. I don't know, you've, have you seen the Brick Post before? He's wow. he's going to have, um, hopefully, like an article just on Lego Ideas based off of 
who I'm interviewing and stuff. So link in the video. Oh yeah. That'd be quite cool. There you go. Finally built the basilisk. Oh, but yeah, podcast. Yeah. Poor little, poor little basilisk. And you got a couple of random pieces again. So at the rate we're going, maybe standalone will finish the set, and everybody will be able to take. <laughs> Tough to do for next week too. <laughs> the basket was the basket with size issues. Yeah, I know. He's a little, tough, a little bit uh, <laughs> oversized on the head. That's weird. Yeah, I suppose if you look at minifig scale, no, no. can't think. Could he be bigger? I don't know. No, he should be bigger. Because then forks is the wrong size as well. But it's so good. I like. I have no problem with the scale. I just think it should be longer. Yeah. yeah. It's a uh, it's something to try. Well, living in the sewers and everything. My contacts at Lego to see what I can do. <laughs> kind of building this strange. I have. Right? I have no contacts at Lego. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? I'd tell you some free stuff. I'm going to go in the chat. Yeah, mini fig. I drink my coffee before I forget. I'll tell you what, that's freaking me out. There's, I've got the little door. And obviously, because you've got a mirror on both sides, I've got it here and I keep seeing things. It's my coffee in the mirror. <laughs> like, what is that? <laughs> freaking myself out. It's like a tap hole. <laughs> I'm uh it kind of does look like a tap hole, doesn't it? Let's give it some legs. <clears throat> Messing around a little bit more with that hidden side app. Do you ever play with it? Is it any any good or not really? It's strange. <laughs> it, like you said, it's kind of like, oh yeah, well this is cool, and then it gets old pretty quick. Yeah, as soon as you've like done it once with that app, you kind of go, Yeah, done it now. It's a bit. I don't think I'm very good at it. I suppose. Don't think I'm very good at it. Did you defeat the boss? <laughs> Negative. <laughs> so I think obviously each one has got a different boss anyway. Each set? Yeah, so each set has got a different sort of boss or daddy ghost, mummy ghost, whatever you want to call them. <laughs> so you got different ones in there. Whatever ghost it was, you whoop my butt. <laughs> right. I think I've got two sets, and I think I've only done it with the the ice cream parlor. I don't even know what it's called. That's how interesting it was. <laughs> the builds are really good, and you get some really good minifigs with it. It's a neat concept, but only in concept. <laughs> but yeah, this is a. I reckon what well, this is my. It's our third Harry Potter set we've built, isn't it? Technically. Uh, yeah, Astronomy Tower, Hogwarts Express, and now this one. I'm just falling because yeah. you were away. Yeah, you did one. Weren't you? Um, the Astronomy Tower. There's not no Astronomy Tower. One Pin uh, Willow. What do you think of the new Harry Potter game? Oh, I don't know. Have you seen that? No. It, it doesn't. It doesn't show a lot. Um, is, is it like the new Lego Harry Potter game? No, no, no. This is like. Uh, like to explain it you kind of you are a wizard and you have to create your own tour uh, tory your own story um but you're trying to everything and it, it the graphics don't look absolutely amazing i think it's going to be is it ps5 only or is it going to be on the xbox as well i'm not sure we'll have to see see what people think in there but it's so yeah. it's mad it looks really good Huh. I might have to check that out. The things I'm really tempted to get a new Xbox when it comes out, the new one. But then that eats into yeah. back ring money. Rick Mad saying that he wants to get a PF, PS5 just to play it. So it's probably the yeah. PS5. It does look really good. I mean, I would show it on here, but I think my laptop will crash. I, uh, I tend to wait like a year before I get new systems. I let them be out for about a year before I get a new one. So I can't wait like that. Every Xbox I've had, I've gone out day one. <laughs> really? So I, I like to get it straight away, but then they're the ones that have the issues, aren't they? 
Yeah, that's kind of why I like waiting. Yeah. And then plus, like, right away, there's always just a couple games, right? There's nothing, anything that really does what the system can do. Oh, no, there's, there's so much coming out. It's, it's like when the new Xbox comes out, it's going to be backwards compatible to pretty much everything. All the titles, yeah. Which is going to be good because last time they took so long to sort it out, but now they know they can get it done really quick. Um, but there's, so there's so, so much. So it's 450 quid for the new. The new uh, Xbox, and I don't get that on PlayStation because a lot of you guys tend to do PlayStation. I will, I'll never buy an Xbox. Lego Daddy Kid, did I miss yeah. much? Uh, no, yeah. um, you missed tons. Standalone bricks is finished, he's on another build, yeah, I, I <laughs> he's done really, really well. This um, is we're on bag two, uh, just done loads of mini figs, just a cool little thing, little door. As Florian said, we've got a tadpole. <laughs> Um, we've got brick clickers in the house. Hello, mate. Thank you for coming along. How's it going, brick clicker? Uh, so, Brickman said, I think you can choose your character. And what you do as well will be a story. In it, but it's a uh, free roam. Yes, yeah, so it's a free, free play. Yeah, you can do what you want. And it's based before all the Harry Potter films, I think. Like way before. I'm sure it's classed as a legacy or something. Do you play as Lily and James Potter? Yes, and then before that, <laughs> it's the old, the old English, the ye old, ye old English. <laughs> Depends on how long before, huh? Before we had, uh, <laughs> before we, um, sorry, I was just laughing at Lego Dad's comment, he's removed the knife. <laughs> <laughs> <Just like, laughs> <laughs> A good film where that says something about a knife. How are you getting on anyway? Standalone, you're doing okay, yeah? I'm gonna put a thumbs up, cousin. Uh, right, bricks all picks. I'm trying to get all the Harry Potter sets. Yeah, I want to get them all. I've got a couple of older ones that I need to get from the last wave. I haven't gotten many of the new ones yet. I got on the astronomy tower, that's it. I haven't gotten Privet Drive, I haven't gotten the Umbridge's Forest or whatever. Oh, yeah, we'll have to get, we'll have to get um, Privet Drive. Yeah, I'm just not a huge rat. Like, it's just other things. Yeah, Elaine said, did I do the burrow build? I haven't got it yet. I haven't got it. i let you down. I haven't got it. I want uh, it. That's the other one I want. Yeah, I need to get it. I would have got it in Toronto, but they didn't have any in stock. Go back to it. Bricklicker says so he's got this. He's going to crack it open. Yeah, build it. We're, we're only going to be building for about another hour, um, and then we're going to continue next week. So I think it's going to be a short stream, but it's good. Uh, right, Florian's asking, what is your favourite Harry Potter mini oh, character? Favourite Harry Potter character? That's quite hard, isn't it? Cause there's so many characters in, in the film. Yeah. I hate Harry because he does my nutting. Hermione does my heading because she's so... Hey, lordy, <laughs> <It just> doesn't... <laughs> yeah, I'd have to say mine is probably Professor Snape because he was in... I Dark. like Snape, yeah. Um... I don't know, that's that is a good question. Yeah, it is. That's a tough one. I don't know, I'd probably say I like Hagrid because I think he's just. Do you know, I learned something. Um, yeah, I'm gonna say Hagrid because I love his character. I love the way you know, with his animals and stuff, and he's just a big softy, isn't he? Um, but I learned something the other day. I don't know if you guys know. You know when they done Hagrid in the films? Yeah, and it was. Uh, Robbie Coltrane. Was it Robbie Coltrane? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> but when they'd done his head, his head was animatronic. It wasn't actually his head. It wasn't him acting most of it. Really? So they had a guy who was quite tall in this really big suit, and then his animatronic head on there, and there was a guy controlling that as well, and it had all pneumatics and air conditioning in there. It was absolutely mad <laughs> i was like really i thought it was just him and they just used cg to make him bigger like they did in lord of the rings well at least it was air conditioned that's good yes absolutely. and they, they gave him a drink as well they fed it through like a long tube to him as well <laughs> <laughs> but yeah absolutely crap i looked and i was like that is weird Isn't it amazing? it's kind of like how they made jar jar banks hey eh? yeah because he just had a on his head didn't he yeah <laughs> like guy walking around in like a some blue suit with a long thing on his head. <laughs> I'd love to have played that. That would have been funny. 
just walk around like kicking things and annoying people. I think that's what I'd probably do. <laughs> just wind people up. <laughs> You're so good for here. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah, that's my Jar Jar Pinks. <laughs> All right, well you heard it here first, folks. I think I could do a Jar Jar Pinks probably better than, um, uh, what's the other puppet? Gollum. I could do a Gollum, but not as good as, not as good as Jar Jar. That was so, pretty so, good. If, if the video, if this uh, stream gets, how many likes are we on? Seven likes. If it gets to 15 likes, I'll do a Gollum impression. That's that's easily obtainable, you guys. You could definitely. <laughs> I could probably do that right now. Hold on. <laughs> I'll do a Gollum impression for everyone. Let's see if I can do that right now. <laughs> see what happens. Oh, there's, 12, there's 12 people watching. Oh, we're we're at 20 likes on the stream already. Is it? Yeah, yours is oh. not up to date. Oh, we're on eight. <laughs> 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 so you lose. You can't you can't see, can you on here? No, I stream here, it's terrible. Yeah, it doesn't really show. Everybody's uh anxiously waiting with Star Jar thing. Yeah. <laughs> Golem or Jar Jar Binks. <laughs> um I'd have to do a video with it. <laughs> I know Solo said he wants to do some some of the comic strips. With some voice acting, so if he needs anything, give me a shout. <laughs> oh, this is gonna get good. I'm not that good though. 22 likes. Yeah, how many did I just say? <laughs> you said 15. Did There's... I say 20? Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure you said 15. We'll have to go back and review the <laughs> review the tape. Uh, is it Brick's Toy says Zolan, Zolan and I will finish the upside down house tonight when Martin is sleeping. Martin doesn't. <laughs> I'll be sleeping soon. Well, I don't know, because I've got, I've got a video to edit for tomorrow. Martin doesn't sleep. Yeah, I should, I should sleep more, but... <laughs> yeah, I've got to do, got to edit a video for tomorrow. If I don't do that, then it's... I've been a bit naughty because I didn't have a video out today. Oh, my goodness. <clears throat> but we're, we're streaming, so I thought that'll do. We'll get on here, chat to some people. You're going to be a seven-day-a-week guy before you know it. Oh, I don't. I don't want to. Not at the moment. I think as long as I've got enough content to bring people, then that's the main thing. And as long as you can do enough and keeps people engaged, it's not me just rambling on. <laughs> <laughs> just rambling on about crap in the boat. Uh, just supposed to. I think just those flames just fit in. They don't. Oh, they do go in properly. Oh, you can stick them in there. Yeah, I had to take the flames out. That's a strange little fireplace, hey? Yeah, quite nice. Quite nice. Looks like the, the flames are too big for the housing. <laughs> so I'm just chuckling to myself now. <laughs> I've lost plot. <laughs> I stand on the got all his tables in. He's ready for dinner. <laughs> uh, what is your favorite quote from the Harry Potter movies? Hmm. Where are you seeing that? Oh, there. Brickman one seven. Um, I got to think of it. I'm gonna say my favourite one. It's not Wingardium Levy Osa. It's Wingardium Levy Osa. <laughs> God, Guardian Levy. <laughs> Good old Harley. Um, knife. That's not a knife. This is. Oh, that's the wrong film. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna agree? get put on the spot and you can't think of anything all i got is professor snipe in my head going potter potter <laughs> it's quite a hard one to to like say to think about isn't it dumbledore's got a lot of good lines a lot of those mysterious make you think kind of lines or, or uh hagrid's i shouldn't have said that <laughs> <laughs> He always says stuff like that. He's like, oh, I shouldn't have said that. My favorite, my favorite scene probably out of the whole movies is when uh, <laughs> when they're in Hagrid's hut and Ron's puking up slugs. <laughs> oh, I love that. 
<laughs> into the body they got a bucket and he's just like <laughs> it's his face as well though isn't it it's probably like <laughs> that's going to be the best scene <laughs> I'm going to have to really watch the Harry Potter films I haven't seen them for a while I haven't seen them for a while either I I've been watching the Pirates of the Caribbean movies yeah see I haven't watched all of them because I've, I've watched a few and I've got a little bit like sidetracked and been by watching them Shadow Wolf, I like the quote. That's rubbish. <laughs> and it's funny because Shadow Wolf is American, and <laughs> that's rubbish. What's and rubbish? That, that's rubbish is just everyday lingo to Martin. <laughs> I'll put it on there because I don't know if if uh, Stanlow can see that. So did you find out how to do Google Translate? Yeah, <laughs> and then uh, Brittle Pixels is. Nearly headless Nick. How can you be nearly headless? Headless, and he goes, <laughs> pops his head off. <laughs> <laughs> you know, one of the characters I do like is I like Moaning Myrtle. I think yeah. her character is absolutely brilliant. She's all proper like whingy. <laughs> <laughs> Reminds me of my sister. <laughs> well, I, I always like the Harry Potter movies. Like I said, I think that. The last two should have been just one. one yeah, they kind of dragged it out a bit. Yeah. But it's because I knew they're going to get a good good bit of money from it. I thought I probably would if I had the money, if I knew what I was doing. <laughs> have you watched any of those Fantastic Beast movies? Say again? The Fantastic Beasts. I've watched the first one. Oh, sorry. No, I've watched them both. The wife's watched neither. I wanted to watch them with them. I couldn't get into it at all. No, nah, the first one's all right. What's his name? Um, New. His his character's quite annoying at times. I guess how it was. One thing about these Harry Potter sets is they come together relatively quick. Yeah. The same. Uh, Bricks or Pixel just said, the "Person that played Mona Myrtle when she was thirty-five. Wow. Yeah. Well, wow, that's Umbridge seems like a sweetheart grandma. Who asks if you want a cookie? Oh, yeah, she's up. Uh, nah, she reminds me of an old teacher I had at school. There was another movie that she played in that. Which is the same. <laughs> yeah, she was very similar. I can't remember what it was, though. Yeah, no, she reminds I had an old teacher at school like that. She was all sweet and innocent, and then soon she, oh, she was a nightmare. <laughs> Sirius Black was a good character. Yeah. And uh, so was Bellistrish. Be Bellistrish? Uh, Bell Bellatrix Lestrange. Be Bellatrix. Bellistrish. That's what's her name. She's been in loads of uh, films. Like British films. What's her name? I can't think of her name, isn't it? <laughs> what is her name? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I think her name is. Uh, Bricks Toys is asking for fit. No, we're not going to finish the set. We're going to go until four o'clock and then yeah. we're 45 yeah. minutes or so. Maybe get through one more bag. If we get through, there's six bags in the set. So I'm shooting for three bags. So. Yeah, we'll get free pretty easily, I think. We're dragging her right out. I'm still halfway through bag two. Martin's probably on bag five. No, I'm still back to put it together and taking it apart three times. He's on some stickers. <laughs> four into. Um, she loves Professor McGonagall. Yeah, she's like proper Irish, isn't she? Oh, McGonagall. <laughs> oh, sure, to be sure. <laughs> That's a very Irish. That was like... What is? Is What's that like, <laughs> like a Lucky Charms guy? Like, like, <laughs> in the Great Hall. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was extremely Irish. <laughs> I do a good Birmingham accent as well. <laughs> They're all really boring sometimes. Talk like this. I'm building the Harry Potter set brick by brick. <laughs> I will stop doing that because I'm going to get togged off. <laughs> For taking the mickey out of other accents. <laughs> I'd like, you know, I'd love to get into doing voiceovers. I think, I think that you know who the best voiceover person in history, in my opinion, was. Robin Williams. Oh, he's brilliant. 
I think they left the Deathly Hallows part one with Harry dead. It would have made part two a lot better. <laughs> what are you uh, looking at? Brick man. Oh, up there. Brick man's comment. <laughs> <laughs> Just been flashbacks. <laughs> Uh, put down the statues and last movie then goes I've always wanted to use that spell yeah so I had so much I need I need to watch it again because there's there's a lot in those films so much to do <laughs> again with the Irish what <laughs> yeah. what you saying <laughs> pretty sure it's Irish <laughs> Yeah, the, the only ones I, I can't do is Liverpudlian for Liverpool. Can't do that. Well, yeah. <laughs> you're trying to sound like you trying to say that you guys don't all sound the same. Yeah, um, no, nah, it's I, uh, Irish. Liverpool accent is really like, I don't know, it's quite hard to do. Quite... <laughs> 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 uh, your wife just killed that duck again. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness! <laughs> I'm just gonna sit here laughing for the rest of the stream. <laughs> yeah, I know. Stand all the go. I don't know why I came on with these two. Yeah, he's like, what? <laughs> Is that bag two? Is he done bag two? No, nope, hang on. That's got to be bag two, right? Yeah, it's definitely all done, isn't it? Oh, yeah, I'm not far back then. That's good. Oh, no, do you know what I'm doing? Just looking at just looking yeah. at what Stanlow's done. I'm, I'm using the wrong piece. I'm using the massive bit. <laughs> what a muppet. There, yeah, it looks a bit better. I thought it looked a bit a bit strange. Oh, man. I'm doing the wrong bit. I feel like I'm way behind now again. <laughs> How come every week I'm the one, like, struggling to keep up? <laughs> I was, I was just laughing at Florine's uh, comment there. She put 100 points for standalone bricks. He's beating you all. But all I could think of was 100 points for Gryffindor. <laughs> 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 That's all I could hear in my head. <laughs> it's like, all right, Gryffindor. You're so, they're so like swatting up to the teachers, aren't they? <laughs> all right. I think mean, that's the funny thing about those films, isn't it? It's like they're right bunch of swats. <laughs> Teachers' pets. How's that going? I have to rewatch the movies, but I don't think they're on Netflix. Or there's only a few of the later ones on Netflix. I think we've got one Sky. Like a satellite service. Oh, there's a little, there's a little cute yellow frog. <laughs> a cute yellow frog. Yeah, cute yellow frog. A lizard in that uh, bookshop that I thought was really cool. He's living in an aquarium now. Oh, was that the chameleon? Yeah, yeah, that's been really nice, isn't it? The little chameleon. Oh, sticker. What am I looking for? Number five. <laughs> Falling right behind. Editing is hard, M and M Productions. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Editing annoys me sometimes because sometimes it works really well. And other times it's like, no, I need to get a laptop anyway. My laptop is rubbish for editing. Editing annoys me because I can I don't have the skills to execute the ideas in my head. Yeah. That's the thing, isn't it? It's like I don't know how to move stuff around how I want to do it. It's yeah. pain. We'll get there in the end. What's turkey leg? A little ice cream cone. Where's that going on there? Sticker five. Minus 50 points for Shadow Wolf for not showing up to Brick Toy's six month anniversary stream. <laughs> was he there? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Lego UK for turning up while making sausage rolls. <laughs> I'd like to know who, who's keeping track of these points and how many do I have? I don't know. We've got, uh, we've got someone nominated for keeping the track of the points. I don't know. <laughs> what are we redeeming these points on? 
If Jazz isn't here, you can do that. <laughs> All right, just a big plate of food, and we are good. Yep. Don't me ice cream. Yeah. Ice cream, we've got a nice cup of tea, anyone? Cup of tea. <laughs> Love a good old cup of tea. Now, this is what I want to get in real life. I want to get, you know, those little mini fig mugs. Have yeah. you seen the actual proper size ones? No. Oh, I want to get one. They look really cool. I've got two pieces. I've got these left over. Well, they go over here. <laughs> I forgot the one by one with little scrolls on them. Right, I think that is book bag two done. I'm getting there. I try to minimize editing because it takes yeah, up time. Yeah, uh, so editing's a pain. I think if I had a super quick computer, it'd be really good. My computer's super quick and it doesn't unnecessarily mean. <laughs> Bag number three. I'm catching up. Oh, I look at all of them in there. They're well, all window pieces. I should be getting the uh, Mose Eisley Cantina tomorrow. As long as you like streaming that build on my channel. Everybody keep an eye open for that. Should be a good time. I don't know how long it's going to take. I'm not going to rush it. Irene's going to read us uh, our predictions <laughs> with some tea leaves. Okay. And I've got five points, apparently. Corey, you've got ten. Stan has got thirty. <laughs> Look at that. All in. Man, I'm gonna try and do the. <clears throat> so I'll try and do a golem impression. Or build himself up to it. <laughs> oh, do you know I haven't done it for a while. So yeah, we've got SW Bricks and Figs just joined us. What's up, SW Bricks and Figs? Bag number three. Good to see it. We are yeah, bag three, and we're building some harry potter set thing doing that <laughs> thing i don't know what it is yet some hall of the great we've got about 40 minutes left to finish this bag i think that's all we can do we've got my precious for me <laughs> <laughs> you've been sitting there as we spoke of this going i really want to do golem please say golem <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wait oh, for <laughs> <laughs> You're so busted. Precious. <laughs> oh, for me. <laughs> Learn us. <laughs> I'm just going to smash all my windows together here before I even start. I'm going to do a whole video, I think. Just do that. <laughs> do you have any Lord of the Rings sets? No, I haven't. No, I should get some, really. Oh, well, I've, I've got the Golem from... Um, uh, what's it called? The dimension set. <laughs> I think Cabbage Face enjoyed that. <laughs> it's like it's called. Yeah, here we go. And then Cabbage Face joined yeah, in babe. just as I was doing that. <laughs> let's uh let's do a thing. Let's say Martin's Friday foil bags have to be done in a golden voice for the next four weeks. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, if if there was some like foil packs um of Lord of the Rings from that, yeah, I'd do it definitely. <laughs> I think you should do Star Wars one in the Golden Boy. <laughs> It'd be like, surely this is the wrong character. <laughs> this is a lot of windows, isn't it? Yeah, like, so I can't really do, I can't really do Yoda. Not, not really doing. Um, what about Kermit the Frog? Because Kermit the Frog is a pretty popular one, right? Yeah, I can't do this. <laughs> Never tried it. You can't. You should sing. Uh, what is that? Somewhere over the rainbow or something. <laughs> <laughs> like, what have that, I walked into? That's good content. <laughs> into the door. <laughs> what have I into? It's <laughs> <laughs> just some random. Me. <laughs> it's me agging on Martin, seeing what we can get out of him for <laughs> the entertainment of many. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I'm going to have to do uh, what's his name. Too much of thing. Oh, crap. Dropping things there. Yeah, Jar Jar Binks doesn't really say a lot, though, does he? Oh, sure. Like, he does. 
Are you kidding me? He's the reason why the chancellor got put into power. <laughs> I try. I got in my head what it is, but I can't think uh, if they've got an impression right now. <laughs> <laughs> no, excuse me. What is it? it was... Potatoes? Where are those? <laughs> <laughs> Rabbits roar and <laughs> That's a pretty good goal. On one. Stupid, stupid Shadow Wolf 99. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you've got that. went down to seven viewers. <laughs> and the viewership plummets. <laughs> got down to two now. Look at them. Yeah. That'll teach you guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Florian B wants me to do a Wookiee battle cry. Uh, I find Wookiees are uh, quite hard to do because you've got to get the right sort of like depth for it. <laughs> Can't do it. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Nope. Go and work. The wife, just, the, the wife just um, <laughs> shouted out from the lounge, you're having a stroke. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, I'm all right. <laughs> yep. <laughs> You've gone down the rabbit hole too far here. Yeah, I'll come back out now. <laughs> Hutz is like, stop talking about you creeping me out. I'll stop, I'll stop. <laughs> All right, there's like 50 windows here. I've done put the screens in almost every single one of them. We're gonna have to do a uh, impressions with Lego fan another time. <laughs> Dedicated stream just for that. <laughs> a whole new series coming. <laughs> Things I can only do silly ones. Can't do it for now. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do a Canadian accent. No. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So I'm going <laughs> Shadow Wolf is off. No problem. Thank you for popping in. Go on step 52 here. I'm warm now after doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I have to just like try and get into character one day when we do a stream on someone's channel and be like, hello. <laughs> Like, is this how he normally talks? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. <laughs> yeah, completely normal. Yeah. Pay no attention. This is normal. <laughs> there is no normal. No, I think if you're normal, something wrong with you. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing oh, that's it. Almost finished bag four. Thanks for keeping my sanity. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, is it that it's difficult or or we just have a roof, isn't it? Oh, just says he's uh, did I miss the impression? Yeah, you'll have to you have to watch it back. <laughs> <laughs> yep, and then Florian, she just said, I love the confidence you guys have. It's strange though, because we've been what is this episode 12? The, the, uh, is it 12 or 13? Yeah, I think it's episode 12. 12 <laughs> from South Park. Oh. 12. Is that so 12 here? Yeah, so it's like, it's, it's weird, isn't it? Because you know, we see each other as just mates, really, don't we? We just have a bit of a laugh. We see everyone in the chat as people we know. And we just, yeah, we just chat to you all. I'm putting on a huge facade. This is not... <laughs> yeah, you get home, you're like, in this the corner. Like, all... Yeah. <laughs> it's not me at all. <laughs> no, I, half the time I forget that we're even on live. <laughs> Sit in the building like, hello, are you there? <laughs> oh, and you're not going to get any impressions out of me. I'm not that confident. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> <laughs> Elaine said that she's it's keeping her sanity, and Brickman's like, no, I think this is uh, he's going to go insane <laughs> from watching this. <laughs> well, we can all go insane together. <laughs> and meanwhile, Standalone bricks, just completing the Great Hall. <laughs> <laughs> How far has he got now? How far he got standalone? 
So he's done what I did. He put all the windows together too. Oh yeah. Yeah. So I'm, I haven't done that yet. I've just left them all bundled up around and wherever they are. All the windows together. Uh, right, well, I've lost what I'm doing because I'm kind of doing my build backwards for some reason. As I always do. I always hold it the wrong way. I love that. I love it though. The wife was like, Are you having a stroke? <laughs> 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 no, I'm okay. <laughs> she knows what I like anyway. <laughs> she wouldn't want me any other way. <laughs> well, probably would, but. <laughs> Bit more stain. Uh, right, stick that on there. I'm excited yeah. for that Mose Isley set, man. I haven't been this excited for a set in a while. He's definitely getting it tomorrow. Oh yeah. It's sitting in it's sitting in Ottawa right now. It's like literally I could probably drive 30 minutes to the sorting facility, but it's closed. Oh, you should go collect it. <laughs> Wait <Wait-a-dole>. the <laughs> door. I've come oh, from his set. <laughs> I don't mind waiting till tomorrow. <laughs> but the thing is, like, I got to go to work and work all day knowing that it's going to be sitting this. And it's not like a little box either. It's going to be some massive box yep. sitting on my doorstep. <laughs> as long as they don't leave it on the doorstep. Oh, yeah, they do. Do they? Well, even if no one's in? Yeah, it's Canada, man. Well, you, your Canada's nice. If you left it outside our door, it, before you even puts it down, it'd be gone. <laughs> oh, no. It, I've had Lego sets sit there for hours and hours. They deliver them at 10 o'clock in the morning, and I don't get home till 6. That's crazy, isn't it? I'll be going home. I'll be like, I'm going home until somewhere else. What uh, oh, we've got Mike, Lego Mike's popped in, pulling the city apart to start a mill system. Oh, that's the, uh, the heightened up system, isn't it? M-I-L-S. So if you're doing modulars, it lifts them up slightly. Oh, really? It's quite a good technique. I've never got into it. Huh. Brixy is giving away uh, an 89 Batmobile. In how many bits in the tub? And and tell tell a joke. Joke. Guess how many bits are in the tub and tell a joke. So he's doing that for his 50,000 subscribers, I guess. Oh, was that Brixy? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> tell us a joke, Brixy. <laughs> See if you can make me smile. I also want the Hogwarts castle. That is... It's going to be Batwing and then Hogwarts Castle for Christmas, I think. Yeah, I can't wait for that Hogwarts Castle. Well, I've got it, but I can't wait to build it. I'm waiting for you to get it. You're going to have to wait. I want to build it with, with you. You can either <laughs> talk to Lego and tell them that... Yeah, I want to build this, but I can't do it until any Hobbies gets one. Can you send it? Got, they got to calm down on releasing sets or they got to mail it to me for free. The uh, cabbage face with me, he said, uh, if I left on my doorstep, I would say it never arrived. <laughs> it probably never would. Um, or they take pictures of it and send it to you saying, here it is. We're leaving it here. You get them in your email. Knock on wood, I had a $400 set sitting on my step and way. Old Taros for two days are still there. <laughs> I'll be worrying. I'll be thinking that's going to be there. This is Canada. <laughs> Canada. Crazy. So I say you couldn't leave it anywhere else. It's not around our way. What am I building? Oh, Hogwarts. <laughs> Grant, you probably find the some of the neighborhoods where you wouldn't want it to sit there. Are you going to yeah. have a look at Brixie's thing then and see if you can guess how many pieces are in it? <laughs> sure. Let's go on there. Just go put six. <laughs> six. <laughs> and he'd be like, no, that's not it. I haven't really watched much of his stuff. I've watched a couple, but yeah, that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> yeah, that one. I've watched a couple. Did he do? Does he do it with his missus? Uh, he live streams a bunch with his wife. Yeah. Yeah. They were live streaming. What are they building yesterday? Um, is it Mose Isaac? Yeah. Is oh, he lied to quite a lot. He's now quit his full time job and taken up that full time, isn't he? I don't know. Yeah, he said I saw something on there about him quitting and doing it full time. Cabbage face. Canada is so much more advanced. I remember <laughs> I my, my package in my bin for the collection day. <laughs> and, they do that, and then they send you a picture 
and go left in a safe place and you're like but how's that safe you've just put it in with the rubbish <laughs> it's just stupid. Yeah. some delivery companies over here are just absolutely ridiculous <laughs> <laughs> common sense not so common anymore <laughs> sure it is. left in a safe place all right elena said bag falls done taking a picture and put it on my instagram yeah do that <laughs> Uh oh, I'm definitely missing a piece. You'll find it in two seconds. There it is. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> Call up the order. Can't it, uh, you order so many from Bricklink sellers, you know, don't fit in your mailbox. <laughs> Just leave it outside. It's like, that'd be, that'd be all right. Luckily, I uh, I send my stuff to my mum and dad's house normally. I know they're always in. I was like, what do you mean your mom and dad's host? You didn't trust me with your actual address? You sent me to their address? The funny thing is, you put my postcode on and my mom and dad's address. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I was like, huh, oh, but it still got there. I don't know how. <laughs> I was expecting it to come here because of the postcode. But no, nah, that's all good. It got there, didn't it? It got there in one piece. I've got some, uh... actually, I need to try those snack things, don't I? Are they horrible? I don't know. No. <laughs> I like I said, man. You so anybody in the stream that isn't up to date, I mailed Martin a Bespin set. Um, it came from Toys R Us, and when they shipped it to me, I just cracked open the box to make sure it was in good condition, and then I closed it back up and sent it to Martin. When he opens the box, he finds a little package of bear claws that Toys R Us was nice <laughs> enough to throw in there as a bonus. Which are like uh, some vegetable-based cracker things. Oh, they're horrible. <laughs> I'm going to try them in a minute. I'll get the windows and then I'm going to go they're, they're a thing. So <laughs> I've never seen it. I've never had them. They're probably really nice. And I'll probably be like, can you send me a few more packs over? <laughs> I don't even know like if they have them in store for purchase or what. <laughs> it's just that's not something I'd be going for. Like I said, you eat them at your own risk. You need to see me run off. <laughs> Things I'll eat anything. <laughs> yeah. That's quite cool, that window, isn't it? <laughs> Big old window. Right, uh, take your... oh, let's go get let's get those snacks. I, mean, I want to try them while we're here. Our, our, this is Brickman from New Zealand. Our courier for Lego doesn't have tracking. But it says it does. They're hopeless. I don't know what I'd do with tracking if I didn't have no idea when I was getting stuff. So that's the box that it came in. And then there's loads of air wrap. And it's in it's in this to come away from Canada. It is like mint condition for that. It is good, hey. And do you know what? I'm I'm not gonna review this, I'm not gonna build it, but do you know what I like about this set? Which I'll show you. Uh, can you see it? You see a bit underneath Luke, that little pitchfork? Yeah. Now, is that an Easter egg that the Lego designers put in to say that he was farm boy? I don't know. Because he had farm boy Luke and he had his little pitchfork thing, didn't he? I know, but that's not farm boy Luke. That's Cloud City. No, but I'm thinking, did they put that in there just to go, oh, I don't know. Um... Look at the back of the box. Look at the picture of the actual movie scene. Can you see that? Yeah. You see that bit down there? No. It's yeah. just a long, long line by the looks of it. I, I don't know. You got a, a thing with finding Easter eggs. Yeah. I think I'd probably look for too much. <laughs> so, what I've got, where is it? Yeah. So, we end up getting these for free. No. Hey. The wife's here, so she's going to do a taste test. Can I do it? No. No, she don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> no. They're, they're, veg, they're made from veggies and fruits. They're very healthy for you. Yeah, you can try one. You guys can try one. You can do no, a camera. No, it's made from Oh, no. I don't know. It might be quite nice. Uh, Le Lego Joe's back in the chat. Wants a shout out. I'm I'm legally contracted no. to say not say Lego Joe. What is up, Lego Joe? <laughs> smell like cheese biscuits. Yeah, they can't smell cheesy. Yeah, smell that? 
Well, they say cheese on the front, right? Yeah, smell it. <laughs> That's a good question. What side would you join, dark side or light side? I'd probably join the dark side. Okay. 100%. Oops. Just, Sorry, I don't know what you said. I was too busy concentrating on eating. <laughs> I'd, be like, uh, I'd be like Mace Windu. Hmm. They're actually quite nice. Remember goldfish? Yeah. I just like goldfish. Come on. Oh, the wife can be adventurous. Okay, you've got to come onto the camera, right? Like, come on. Come on. Look, you've got a hand. We've got a hand. We've got an arm. <laughs> 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 that is what you can see of the wife. <laughs> We're building across the pond, episode 100. We'll get mm. there. She says a really nice, right? Corey, if you can find some of these, the yeah. wife will pay you. You mm. want some more? Mm, they're nice, they are. Well, I'll have to go to Toys R Us and see if they just sell them by bulk. Sell them. <laughs> just sell them toys. You have to buy loads of best bin sets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I think. I think uh, I think you might be able to buy them by the bulk, like by the pallet. <laughs> yeah, I'll buy a pallet for them. Quite salty though, considering they're made from fruit and veggies. They're really salty. Do they have a date on them? Like, do they say expires in July 2016 or something? That's fine. I always eat that back stuff. <laughs> <laughs> do you know, I don't even think it's got an expiry date on it. They last forever. Oh, it's on the front. Oh, God, that's a long date. That's what I think it is. March 25. <laughs> We're good until 2025. Yeah. So yeah. get me a load of those. If you have a zombie apocalypse, sort of. <laughs> <laughs> just eat them forever. Oh, oh, they are salty. They're nice, but they are salty. So Brickman said that he'd be a, he'd be a uh, bounty hunter and on the grey side. On the grey side, yeah, it's like a, like Mace Windu, right? Yeah, sort of like what we're looking for. Okay. There you go. So you guys probably saw standalone bricks finish this about an hour ago. Now, <laughs> now I'm there. Where is he there? Look at that. There's so many windows. There we go. Wow, that's what we're aiming towards. Yeah, oh, man. I feel like I am so. Far. And then you look at you look at what we've got. We've <laughs> it's a mere shell. <laughs> oh well. Uh, Lego Joe, Lego Joe, I shouted you out, man. I think Lego Joe, Lego Joe. Three bags done. Now oh, he's finishing there. And we feed them to our children. <laughs> Imagine if they put minifigures, crisps, and bags like floppy joys. Yeah. That'd be great. You get one inside, you'd be going, people go mental. Yes, I think standalone, he's finished bag three, isn't he? Yeah. Is he going to adventure onto bag four? I don't know. The suspense is killing me. <laughs> well, we can save it for next next week. You can do. We got oh, he's gonna crack it open. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> he's doing it. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. No. <laughs> <laughs> he's uh, like, shall I? Shall I not? <laughs> that's perfect. Well, you could come over here and help me put window pieces together. I need eight of them. So many of these, isn't there? Not repetitive at all. <laughs> could you imagine um, Brickman saying, all the Lego fans would be feeling the crisp packets. I'd be like, why are all my crisps crushed to death? <laughs> <laughs> like, crunching them. I like, oh, will find one in there. They're just dust packets with <laughs> <laughs> just packets of crumbs. <laughs> so, who all thinks we're getting Star Wars CMF series? Oh, I, I hope so. Um, do you know? I reckon they might do a Clone Wars one. Yeah, all different clone troopers. So you can't tell which is which. <laughs> they got the feel. <laughs> feel them. They all feel exactly the same. <laughs> 
<laughs> you, just, you just have to keep buying them. To find, uh, just get the same ones over. Over. I suppose it'd be a good way to build an army. I think we're going to see them. I think nice. we in battle pass. So all they've got to do is sort out their licensing issues, don't they? That's all they've got to do with Hasbro. Well, Disney could have stepped up and said, hey, we want Lego to be able to do this, right? So change your terms. Yeah. You can't tell me that Lego minifigures takes away from Hasbro action figure sales. No, because Hasbro the ones are completely different. They're completely different. Yeah. They should do a creature pack. That'd be quite cool. All the different creatures. <laughs> I don't know how they do that, though. <clears throat> oh, I'm going to set up a whole, uh, like, Tatooine scene. Yeah. And uh, with Luke's land speeder and Obi-Wan's hut and Yoda's hut and the new Mos Eisley. Okay, so you're just, that's on Dagobah. Never mind. I retract that too. You can put it there as well. He's moved. <laughs> that's that sand color. <laughs> just, that's his summer holiday house. There you go. There you go. Eight of these puppies. Yep, yeah, I've done them there. <coughs> I've got seven of these bricks. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be interesting, wouldn't it? See if they can do that. Because if they end up getting that done, are they then going to be able to do a Marvel CMF? That would be cool. There's so many characters that you can have from the Marvel Universe. Oh, gosh, yeah. Star Wars CMS would get me into CMS, so... <laughs> That's the problem, isn't it? Is you don't want to get into too many, especially the old ones, because they're an absolute fortune to get. Yeah, I don't think I'd go back in time very far <coughs> where are these going this one oh wow. yeah this cool. <laughs> love the way they did this <laughs> who uh who uh who will finish last who <laughs> we're gonna build who will finish last i think we're just doing this last one aren't we because we're at one, one hour 20 minutes yeah what eight of these to put on as well? Oh my god! And uh, this is kind of the halfway point too. Yeah, it's quite good actually. Isn't it? It's quite a good point to stop at. Well, so we're doing an hour and a half because uh, this Thursday, is... Tuesday. How old are you? Twenty six. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> twenty six. You're not really twenty, is he? Forty five. <laughs> he looked up there like what? <laughs> how old I don't know. How old will you be? Could you I will be 42 years of age. You go, 42. No, same age. Yeah, same as wife. How old are you? 41. 41. <laughs> How old are you? All right. <laughs> um, this isn't that's, good. That's not a good thing to ask, is it? Is ask the wife how old she is. <laughs> I have one of these left. This could not be good. What's that? What you got left? One of these. Hang on, where are you? You're there. You put seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, eight, sorry. Three, yeah. Six, seven. So it goes back here. Goes <laughs> on. I got it. Call off the alarm. But Daily okay. Brick, he's in, uh, mate. Thanks for joining us. And then <laughs> Brick's oh. toys are here. That is. Oh, weird. they need to do that. Force ghosts. That is awesome. What do you reckon? Force ghosts. Oh crap! Oh no! <laughs> you gotta <laughs> use too much pressure, man. I always do. You've used <laughs> too much pressure. I literally <laughs> just flung it. This is a bad thing. <laughs> it's been an earthquake at Hogwarts. Disaster. I don't know where that bit's gone. I'm going to have to fish it out. Look on the floor. Come on, let that go. We got our phoenix that can't sit on anything. <laughs> Can you sit the phoenix up here? He's nearly the same size as the basilisk, isn't he? Nearly. 
That's a really cool way of doing these windows, aren't they? We'll put, put our headwig up on the top there. Lex is here from the Daily Brick. How are you, Martin, Corey, and Standalone? We are good. Oh, I think Standalone's gone. I didn't, did he wave goodbye? Oh, did he wave goodbye? I don't know. I didn't see. I was trying to find my piece. <laughs> Make sure you pay attention. If you blink, <laughs> you just might miss something. But yeah, anyone check out Standalone's channel. It's good to have him on, have him doing a build with us. I say we've finished up to bag four. I don't know. Is that <laughs> Hagrid? Is that the same one as in Diagon Alley? Um, it's the same one that's in Hagrid's hut. Yeah, same fig. Oh no, uh, I can't tell if I'm taking out. What do you mean? Look at the picture in the manual, man. Yeah, no, compared to that, no, it's the same one from the old uh, diag diagonally, diagonally, not straight down, diagonally. Yeah, diagonally. <laughs> uh, Brick's cool. laptop died during a stream. Yeah, we. I saw that. Yeah, you need to keep it plugged in. <laughs> oh, it's back on there. Oh, wait, back in the chat. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what do you guys think about the Saturn V re-release? I'm a bit bummed out about it. I have no. Yeah, I spoke to Brickman the other day. Yeah. Uh, when I said about that. Yeah. yeah. What was the original price? I would be bummed out about it too if I paid this markup price for it and then they brought it back. But <laughs> that's the problem, isn't it? People were buying it sort of secondhand as such, and then uh, yeah, ended up that happening, which is always good. Yeah. Right. Like I said, it's kind of the risk you take, right? When you. Yeah, that's it. You play the Lego game, you win some, you lose some, but I'm gonna put a massive spam in the chat. You got more. Uh, what link. do you think of these paper bags that their Legos coming out at with? I don't know. I keep my plastic ones anyway, don't I? Because I'm strange. <laughs> well, yeah, like the paper should not stand the test of time the way the plastic does, right? I don't know what they how thick it is and what they've done. So there might be something quite thick on there. Um, not sure. I've just popped a link in before we carry on with that, just on, on the chat with my Lego ideas. Anyone wants to get on there, hit it up. That'd be cool. Give me some support. Yeah, so I, I quite like the paper, these plastic ones because you can see what you've got inside them. I know that you're going to see when you open them anyway, aren't you, when there's paper ones, but I kind of – I like that noise. But they're terrible, terrible for the environment. So, no, mine are right. Mine stay in the in the boxes. <laughs> they should come in a reusable bucket. And you do is you get the set, you dump the bucket out, and you return it for a deposit, and you get a new bucket when you buy a new set. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'll probably have about four hundred buckets sitting in my lounge. Yeah. <laughs> it's all branded as Lego as well. <laughs> don't, don't do that. Yeah, okay. it's, no, it'd be interesting to see how they do it because it's not going to be just paper, is it? There's going to be something. Like yeah. woven into it, it's going to be so a bit tougher. Like uh, our money, our money out here is like paper money, but you can't tear it, rip it. Yeah, like it doesn't burn. You can wash it through the washing machine. It doesn't it's like poly, it. polymer or something. Same as yeah. ours. But yeah, it looks it's like a plasticky paper yeah, it's weird. thing. We've got Stephen Baker in. I didn't. I don't know if he's been in earlier. Uh, I'm not long. Brought Saturn second hand. Yeah. Yeah, it's one of those things, isn't it? It's kind of they've gone, yeah, we're going to re release. So, now, are we going to get Ghostbuster sets again? Are they going to re release them? Are they going to re release? Well, they said they're, they're talking with an Ecto 1 re release on the creator lineup. Uh, Saturday. Yeah, they do the big one, aren't they? Yeah, so they're kind of doing that different. If they're going to do the smaller one again, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, it's going to change change things a bit. So I, think, I think they're just doing a test as well, aren't they, to see how, how it's going to go. Saturn Five is going for, it's going for about four hundred dollars right now, Canadian. What's that? The Saturn V. Yeah. Five, 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 five. I can't speak. The Roman <laughs> numeral five. Yeah, the, the V. Um, but let's see what the Brickipedia. So Elaine's saying they're they're saying they're spending over three three billion to redo the bags. The thing is they've. It's going to be a trial, first of all, isn't it? They're saying they're trialing it in some of the sets. 
So they might not even do it. They might do it for a little while. People might say, no, it's rubbish. They split and go everywhere. We lose pieces. So it was released on June 1st, 2017. Originally sold for $119.99 in the States or £109. Came with 1,969 pieces. So for 120 bucks, and now it's going for 400. And if they re-release it, you'd think they'd come out relatively at the same price as they yeah. were at. Oh yeah, yeah, I think it'd be. I reckon it'd be one forty, maybe to give it another twenty, so twenty pound, twenty dollars on top, because they probably think, oh, the retail is four hundred. You get three astronauts with it and a lunar yeah. lander. They're the little mini ones, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, it'd be well, interesting. They say mini figures, like they're actual mini figures. Oh, they're not the little micro statue things. No. Yeah, it'd be interesting. Right? See, see what it does. But, yeah, this um. Yeah, interesting. But I think if, there's a couple of space ones that are in the next review that comes out in October, and I think that might get they, they might get the the nod to be built. But you think the original designers? I don't know how many that Saturn Five were sold. They're probably I don't know. But you think they're getting one pound, one dollar per sale? Yeah, since um, since 2017. Yeah. That's a fairly popular one. Yeah, uh, that's all sold. I, I mean, saying they spent three billion dollars to redo the bags. Yeah, so they better work. Uh, <laughs> brick man, they, sell my Saturn, but probably won't make any more. Stand they're one of the other companies that have made a really good profit, haven't they, over this COVID period? The Lego, uh, the Lego Amazon, group. Amazon, yeah, Lego group really made, yeah, Amazon done well as well, and they, yeah, Lego Group have made, I think, over a billion more than they did this time last year. Saturn uh, five. I think they can afford to invest. <laughs> I just want to say thanks to uh hard to and have a look and see if you can get a support. As long as you've got a, a Lego account, you can go on there and you can support that. Anyone want a bear paw? <laughs> oh nice these. Not very tell you, it's very little amount of salt to these. Anybody want a bear paw? Eight percent. That's a lot. Eight percent of your daily allowance is salt in that. <laughs> yeah, they're quite nice. So yeah, we'll be definitely picking up this set on my channel next week. Building yeah, on episode thirteen. Yeah, we're on. Well, we one hour of twenty-seven minutes. Yeah, or do I go make yourself some birthday lunch? <laughs> yeah, I gotta go make some dinner. Some. They've been good. Chicken. Make sure to check out Standalone Bricks channel. Um. Yeah. And I'll say, yeah, we're going to go on your channel next week, aren't we, next Sunday? Yeah. Over uh, on my channel. And, again, I'm going to be doing uh, a bit of a birthday haul video coming up on Tuesday. It should be out if everything works out the way I think it will. I'll show you guys everything that I got for my birthday because it happens to all be a Lego. All of it. <laughs> Buddy, it's it's Lego. And some boxes as well. Yeah. There's <laughs> some boxes coming. And... Uh, so watch for that whole video of mine, and then I'm going to definitely be streaming the Mose Isley build next week, starting next week. Like I said, I'm going to take my time with it. I'm not going to go crazy. Yeah, just do a few bits I'll join you if I can as well, if you want me on at like uh, one in the morning or something. <laughs> I, I really bring you on. You, you know, come in with your impressions, stealing the yeah, <laughs> Like I'm, I'm the favorite. <laughs> of course I'll have you <laughs> no, right, we had a good stream it's been been good um, I, can't, hope, I can't believe how fast an hour and a half goes yeah it goes really quick doesn't it? hopefully you'll get a parcel from me soon Fingers well crossed. i'm kind of hoping that that's like a monday thing so it hopefully. can be thrown in there too how long it takes to get to you because i'll try to think when i sent it um it took you know probably seven or eight day business days for it for the best been set to get to yeah, you. It's been 11 days since I sent, sent that to you. Yeah. I really hope it turns up tomorrow or, or Monday for you, or Tuesday for you. Oh, I'll keep an eye out. <laughs> In production, it's like, don't go, please don't go. <laughs> oh, standalone Brooks's birthday is on the 23rd. Yeah, mine's on the 22nd. Hey, there you go. You have a oh, joint birthday. It's a great time of year to be born. All the Mine's best. March, ages away. Uh, well, if you want want some more, I got a video that came out today on that little 
toad mock that's behind me here right there you can check that out I'll show you guys how to build that fairly simple martin's got a couple videos with the back batwing reaction and what he thinks about the batwing coming out yeah, I, I might i might have a review out for dying alley on wednesday if i'm gonna bother to finish it <laughs> it's a big step to go over man. Gave up, but yeah so we say let's say who we've had in the stream today who have we had i'll start as far as i can at the top We've had Mr. Barry, he's been in. Brickman, 179, M Production. Shadow Wolf's been in. Uh, Florine's been in. Uh, Shadow Wolf, I've said him already. <laughs> Cabbage Face. We've had Bricks Toys. Brickmaster. Eileen's been here. Lego Mike popped in. Bricks or Pixel. I'm sure there's another. Who else we have in? Lego Joe's in. <laughs> The screen, Mr. Barry, Eileen, M Productions, Standalone was with us. Thank you for coming on to the stream. Huts, always Steve a true. Baker. Yeah, and we've got Just Build It's just come in and say hi, and we'll say bye because we we're just about to go. <laughs> I go, Joe, Daily Brick was here. Lots of people during this. It should, it should give you like a list of who's been in rather than just the comments that'd be quite nice to see who's been in i might have to mention that to uh someone i don't know where yeah. you, want to talk, you want me to talk to my people yeah let's talk to them say wait it's all out but that's yeah. been right so next week next sunday burn across pond episode 13 finishing off the whatever this is great hall <laughs> of course it's called then it's a great hall and i think what i'm gonna do is I'll pull my other harry potter sets down so we can kind of check out hooking them all up yeah for sure cool. right well thank you guys for coming along stay safe see you again soon see you guys bye